guys welcome back to my channel so today's video is going to be a what's in my diaper bag video i'm going to be answering all the questions that you guys always have you guys always ask me where's my diaper bag from what's in my diaper bag literally anything related to the baby you guys want to know where i get it and all that good stuff so today i'm gonna be telling you guys everything about my diaper bag what i put in it and i have not had to try out any other bag i've had this one since my baby was born thank god i loved it so without further ado let's go ahead and jump right into the video i'm trying to link everything down below in the description you know it's okay about anyone that's watching the video maybe you are expecting or you want to switch out your diaper bag and all the items inside so i'm gonna go ahead and link down everything that i could find in the description so this is my diaper bag so it's pretty big i know a lot of people don't like big diaper bags but i personally prefer to be ready like you know i rather be safe than sorry and this is the one i went with i picked it out when i was pregnant and you know first time mom i didn't really know if it was gonna work out if i was gonna like it so i was like you know what? i'm just gonna get it um it was actually a gift i put it in my baby shower um wish list and i got it as a gift in my baby shower and i was praying that it would work out because you know like it's a little pricey but i totally love it and i don't regret one bit placing it in the wish list so um here it is i went with the color black since you know your debit red is going to be in your car in the stroller out and about like it's gonna get dirty so i went ahead and got the black one and you know that way it can match with anything that i wear or you know anything you know i'm the type of person that likes to match like the purse and the shoes and the stroller like i don't know i'm a little bit crazy so we're gonna go ahead and start with this pocket right here i love this bag because it has a bunch a room and a bunch of pockets i like to have everything like divided and easily to find so we're gonna go ahead and start with this pocket up here so in here i usually place my wallet because i if i'm using this bag i usually never use my purse i just go in with my wallet and my keys i put them here i don't need anything else but if i do want to use my purse that day i'll just take out my wallet and use my purse and put this under the stroller okay so in this pocket right here i pack clothes so you know babies spit up they have blowouts you know the whole deal so i personally like to pack two extra outfits so i'm gonna show you guys okay so here are her outfits two outfits pretty simple pants and a shirt um babies don't really take that much space with the clothing i mean i thought that the older she got it was gonna be harder to pack the things but she's almost nine months and everything fits perfectly fine i like to pack a little sweater because you know the weather over here is a little bipolar so that's that and i like to pack the blanket so this blanket i could cover her stroller if it's like sunny and she's like fall asleep or whatever and just put it over the car seat um if it's a little cold but not really like when we go to the doctors or stuff like that so i like to have this and then the big blanket like the heavy one i just leave it in the car since we barely use it it's very hot over here so this is what i have for like clothing and blankets and stuff like that so this is the first pocket then we have these two pockets in the front which right now they're not being used for anything um i usually have this um filled with small bottles like water or stuff like that if we're going out for a really long time but today is not the case so then we have this small little pocket right here here i like to put my keys since it's so easy to find you don't have to be going crazy looking for your keys and a hand sanitizer and a chapstick so that's what i have in the little pocket easy to find straight right there so that's where i put my keys and then we have the big pocket so i'm gonna give you guys a little overview it has four pockets and then a big middle section i love that it's like very divided so it's everything so easy to find so in one of the pockets i have two binkies in this like plastic case i don't know where i got this case from i know it was from another binky but i just got it in place two guys 
you don't understand how much um, my daughter loses her binky, so I like to have extras. Then we have her hair brushes, just in case, you know, she falls asleep, her hair gets super messy, and, you know, we're going somewhere. I just like to have her everything, like, super cute and ready for her. Then on the other pocket, we have two burp cloths. She... It's pretty big right now. We barely use these, but you know, if she has like a mojito coming out, or I don't know, she's drinking water and it's like dripping. I don't know. Whatever the case is, I just like to have those. And I also have a um, bib. I have a bib, but we barely use these before when she was little. We had to use these way more often. But you know, I just packed one just in case she needs it for whatever the case is. But you know, she's pretty big already. The next pocket we have is diaper rash cream. I always have this. This is so good. Um, she has never had a rash, so this is awesome. If you guys want to try out this brand, I absolutely loved it. Then we have socks. So I like to have socks um for her just in case, you know, her for her little shoes, like she loses one or it's cold, whatever. Um, I like to have it then I have this I don't even know what you call this like her little pump I don't know what this is too the little sucky thing to take out her boogers or um, you know Okay, so my baby when she was smaller She was having um a lot of like fluid when she would drink milk Um, she would have like a lot of gas and milk would come out through her nose and her mouth and we had a very scary situation happened to us um when she was very young um so ever since that happened um we had to call the ambulance which was terrified she was only two months at the time and i didn't have this little pump sucky thing that they gave us at the hospital and i remember the ambulance guy he's like i recommend you have this with you 24 7 in your diaper bag that way if you're at the house you could just get it from your diaper bag or if you're out and about you have it in your diaper bag and you never forget it so ever since that day, I put this in my diaper bag and I don't regret it one bit, guys. This is like a lifesaver. She would have like reflex coming, reflex or reflux? I don't even know right now. Um, and you just put it in her mouth and suck out everything and from her nose. So this is a lifesaver. I would recommend you having this in your bag, you know, for mojitos, for like whatever the case is, you just have it. Guys, it was really bad. Okay, uh, next we have this right here. I use this for her milk, her formula, and her little cereal, which I use when we go out. You know, if she needs to feed or whatever. So I'm not going out for a long time today, so I only packed one. But I know there's different containers. I've seen other moms um, use ones that are different that they actually like stack up and stuff. And those are super cool, but I had these like i have a lot of these that i got gifted so i just use those they work for me so and then we have diapers i pack around five or six diapers because my baby likes to poop and um pee a lot so i just have extras just in case i never use all of them but i have them in there when i see that they're like running out like two or three left i just restock them again and then i have her wipes i don't use the hard plastic cover ones i just use the ones that the brand um you know like the box with the white piece comes in so these are really soft like the outside so literally you see it's like easy to like um stack it in there and you know like i think the hard cover ones um take up a lot of space so i like these better so this is what i have for her wipes then we have two pockets on the side which is where i usually put her bottles i have one bottle for her formula and i have one for her actual water since she is already um eating solids i have water for her um every time i go out i usually always take a bottle and i leave like the, her actual food for here in the house or if we're going to like a family member's house i will pack her food in here like her solids but i usually always go with a formula bottle since it's easier if you're in the car or you're out and about it's easier you don't have to like heat up anything so 
No. And then the last pocket we have is the back one. And here, since my baby is teething, I like to pack two or three little toys for her to like play with or chew on. So I have this one right here. Um, these are both um, teething toys and, you know, toys at the same time. So these are perfect. They fit perfectly in the back and um, she uses them a lot. And then I also have her bows. I kind of match it with whatever outfit I have packed. So I put it in here. Um, if it's not in here, it's on her. And maybe she falls asleep, I just take it off and then, you know, put it back on. So I just like to have two different um, bows or hair ties or whatever the hell I'm using for her hair that day. Um, I like to pack it. I like for her to be super dressed out and cute. I also will um, put shoes that she has on that day for her outfit. I put it in this pocket right here. So this is basically what's in my diaper bag. Um, I don't really over pack put the essentials i like to be ready i like to be safe rather than sorry so i just um this is basically what i use i have been using the same thing for the past almost nine months never had to change my bag um i really really love the bag and it's super easy to clean you can just throw it in the washer and you can wipe out some parts since it has like leather here and here so i really really love the bag everything inside is super easy to find and stuff so also you could hold it like this you could put it like this or it has a long strap i have a long strap that you could put it like here on your arm i never um put it on me i just put it under the stroller and it's easy so that's pretty much it for today's video guys hopefully it helps out any expecting moms or moms that are trying to find a new bag i love this bag and i think that if i ever have baby number two i could fit both of their things in here so that's pretty much it guys thank you so much for watching don't forget to give this video a huge thumbs up if it was helpful or if you enjoyed it comment down what you have in your diaper bag and comment down if you think i should have anything else in my diaper bag i'm a first time mom and you know i like to like read and find out new things and you know try to help myself for my babies like being or whatever um so let me know if you think i should add anything else since i am a first time mom but i have been using this for a bunch of months and nothing has happened thankfully everything is there where i need to find it so yeah comment down if you think i should add anything else or what you have in your diaper bag any other video suggestions please leave it down below in the comment section i always try to answer you guys in the first hour of my video going live so that's pretty much it guys thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys on my next video bye guys